Okay guys, hey, Adam Wahlberg here from Seed Concepts. Um, we're shooting a quick video today showing you guys we're out in the field here uh, and looking at this field here, we drive by it from the road, everything looks pretty good. Now we got in the field, you can see down the road here, see how dry we are, see how much uh, stress this plant's probably maybe one under through the course of the year. Um, so getting in here, walking through, the stalks were kind of brittle, it seemed like. Um, so what happens is we pulled some, pulled some leaves off here and we're looking at stalk quality. Um, so that's one of the things we want you encourage you guys to look at go in your fields and see where your stock quality is um, going into harvest this year. Are there fields that maybe we need to take for uh, silage instead of grain due to stock quality? Um, so what happens is quickly right here, it's a very simple. We'll show you guys how to test your own corn. But this one here, this plant actually I cut it open. Um, you can see how it has those black the black marks on the inner nodes here, and we can kind of squeeze it and cut it open so it hasn't really it's starting to pith out on the inside here. Uh, and then on this one here, it was, you know, the plant went down. You can see it all mangled up. You can see the pink coloration. That's fusarium. Um, that's a uh, uh, stalk rot disease that we have in corn. And corn can go down um, pretty easy when we have that and, uh, with winds and rains and stuff come, maybe coming. Uh, we could lose corn. Actually, when I'm sitting here today, I had corn falling down that nobody was touching. Um, so what, now we're going to transition to, we're going to show you guys how to go out and check your corn to see what your stock quality, see if there is issues. There may not be, but sometimes there are.